This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. Okay, let's get into the news. All right, so the hot topic for today is 50 Cent and Daphne. Now, Daphne, <laughs> Daphne Joy put out some strong allegations against 50 Cent. First 50 Cent told her that she's a sex worker. I didn't know you were a sex worker, you little sex worker. Because in that little Rod lawsuit, she's named as a sex worker that gets a pay stipend. Now she has come out and said this is completely false and she'll be taking uh, legal action. Now 50 Cent said, you moved a mile away in hopes of having another baby with me, but I was busy. So you moved back and then you started receiving money from Brother Love. Now, here we are, you little sex worker. Well, Daphne Joy wasn't happy with this, so she put out a statement about 50 Cent. Now, 50 Cent has been going harder at Diddy. No Diddy. <laughs> no Diddy. <laughs> because Daphne Joy chose to smash Diddy and not chase 50 Cent anymore. They have a kid together. He wants full custody. She put out a statement. She said, at 50 Cent, everything is a joke to you until our safety is compromised, which is happening now. You're, uh, you are wrecking real, wreaking real havoc, sorry, <laughs> wrecking, wreaking real havoc, frenzy and chaos onto people's lives. How would you feel if Sire was uh, in handcuffs for nothing? We moved to New York to give you the opportunity to be a father to your son. And you saw him 10 times out of the two years we lived there, one mile away from you. I am tired of upholding and protecting an image to our son that you have never even cared for. And you haven't even earned, uh, sorry. Uh, let's put the real focus on your true evil actions of hard R, her, okay, taking advantage of her, and physically abusing her. You are no longer my oppressor, and my God will handle you from this point on. You have permanently damaged the last hope I had for you as a father to preserve the family. See, so she's mad, right? So she's putting that on him. She would have, she would have, if he had done that to her, she would have said that earlier. You got to be careful when you, uh, <laughs> you scorn a woman because it'll go right to this. Now, who, who, out of who, out of Diddy and, uh, 50 Cent, who would do this? Diddy would probably, right? But she doesn't like him adding, you know, fuel to the fire by calling her a sex worker, right? 50 Cent now is probably going to have to take legal action against her, but she can take legal action against him. It's just a big mess. And you have a kid involved. 50 Cent uh, <laughs> knows how to mess things up. I'll tell you that much. Okay? Because eh, you probably shouldn't be treating the mother of your children like that, like you did the last woman, you know? Um... Drake, Drake and uh, Kendrick Beef. Well, uh, Kevin Durant takes his side. He chooses Drake. Now, talking about this more, Drake put this out earlier. He said uh, they would rather go to war with me than admit their own th that they're their own worst enemy. Birdman commented, "F them." And then adding to the mix, there's a lot going on here. Uh, Kanye jumps in the Kendrick conversation. He says, everyone knows I wash Kendrick on no more parties in L.A. Everyone knows I wash Drake at the Free Hoover concert. Everyone, <laughs> everyone knows I brought Adidas into this culture. No, you didn't. And I took them out. Run DMC brought Adidas into this culture, but they were already part of the culture before that. Adidas just embraced hip hop more in the beginning. 
uh, they gave Run DMC a shoe deal. So Kanye, fall back on that. Everyone knows a lot of Demna, Virgil, Carrie, uh, Jerry, Kim, all work for me. I made Yeezus, Dark Fantasy, Pablo, Graduation, Throne, 808s, I made Runway Devil, and A New Dress, Father Stretch, I am the only person to come back to number one after cancellation. There is only one goat. I stand by me. My friends call me yay. Bro. <laughs> Now, little baby is painting his nails now. And, uh, yep, yeah. he's never been the same since the Michael Rubin parties where he was getting sandwiched and hugged. And that looks like abuse to me. <laughs> um, Bun B is getting sued for a million dollars for stealing this uh, some other burger place's recipe for Keep It Trill. I don't know, bro. How secret? How great can a burger be? How much? How secret can a burger recipe be? BFB to Pac Man is supposed to get a Drake verse, but they had to remove it. So I guess it's not going to be on there today. That sucks. I, he deserves it. He's been working hard, man. I always say his name wrong. Is it BFB or B? I, I don't know, but he's good. Anyways. This is Jordan Tao with JT News. I appreciate you all. I'll check you on the next one. Smash that like button for me. Peace.